Unique landscapes along the Connecticut River have left many farmers challenged during all the rainy summer days. And as we get ready for what could be a wet summer, Western Mass News stopped by one farm to learn more. We're always looking forward to the next season, no matter how bad the previous season was. As part of farming, you just have to be optimistic. Will McKinstry, owner of McKinstry's Market Garden, tells Western Mass News he's ready for a bounce back season after a rainy 2023. The Hadley-based farm is already seeing asparagus peak out in rows. But McKinstry is wary of those April showers. It just makes it harder for us to do our job. We have to figure out, um, move equipment around and, and do our lighter fields first, um, plow those first before we can get into the heavier fields. So it makes it a more logistical nightmare than anything else. A nightmare as they figure out which fields are drying out fastest. He credits different types of soil for the challenges that come with farming during rainy seasons. Rain makes it uh, hard for us to get into the field. If we get a lot of rain, depending on the type of soil, some of our heavier soils, we have to wait up to a week sometimes to get into that field with the heavy equipment. Last year, midsummer flooding left many fields in the valley of the Connecticut River untouched. Last year was, was bad when it came to um, shelf life and, and stuff of the vegetables. The rain really impacted that. And while we wait to see what this year's growing season holds, McKinstry leans on the fundamentals he's grown up on. There definitely could be too much rain. You can always add water and irrigate, but you can't take it away. Hadley's well-known asparagus festival is set to kick off on June 1st. But in the meantime, McKinstry Farm is holding a pick-your-own asparagus in their fields. Well, speaking of